Hello critics, this is Rated TSM here, and have I been lazy? Yes. Am I in Korea? Yes. So I'm going to just upload all of those product review videos and all those other videos that I was supposed to upload before I came to Korea and just never did. So you're just going to see all of those pretty much all at once throughout the day. So yeah, just prepare for it. Hello critics, it's Rated TSM here, and welcome back to another random days where we talk about everything not Korea or Japan related. And where we're today, we're going to be talking about another product review because that's pretty much all I do for random days is our product reviews. Sometimes I might talk about something else if I get a request to talk about something else for random days. But today we're going to be talking about the Bliss Drench and Quench Cream to Water Hydrator for all day moisture because everything that I buy seems to have a very long name. So here's what it looks like on the inside and let's just hop right into this product. The first issue that I noticed is that it smells bad when you put it on in the morning. Even if you wash your face off from the previous night, it smells bad. I mean, I could smell it on my skin like, oh my gosh, what is this horrible smell? that I'm sniffing into my nose right now. So I stopped putting it on in the morning. Then here is what else occurred. I don't know why, but it started to make me break out. You see, I wore this, put this on for months, months and months and months and months and months. And eventually my skin just started to react differently to it. Yeah, maybe my skin was reacting to it the whole time, or maybe there's some bacteria in it, I don't know. But all I know is that my skin no longer likes it and decided, okay, we're gonna break out because you keep putting this mess on us. So when I first bought this, it definitely would have been, and I guess it's nice and, like this is a thick amount, but it's nice and watery, so it's not too thick. I'll just put it on my leg. Like, eight, when I, I would have given it, definitely given it a five out of five. Now I pretty much give it a two out of five. I mean, I give it a two, I guess, because it still is kind of nice and moisturizing. But this is definitely not for people with sensitive skin, apparently, because my skin started breaking out. And I'm sad because this costs about $17. That's also this other reason why it's a 2 out of 5. It's because the price is, a, is terrible. I do not think this is worth $17 at all, okay? And I used like, a Target gift card to buy it, so that's why I was able, okay, I'm going to go buy this, do a product review. But no, 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 no. Do not buy this, okay? I've had this for months. And even though you could say that this is pretty good if you've had this for months, if you don't have sensitive skin, I just can't recommend this. I just can't recommend this at all. So that I actually also put this and pair this with another product that I'll be doing a review on too later. So I'll just tell you what that product is in the next video. But that's all I got for you guys today. If you like this video and want to see more videos, please hit the, hit the like and subscribe button. Please don't forget the notification bell so you can be notified every time a new video comes out. And also um please hit the description box down below so that you can follow me on instagram twitter or snapchat and check out my go find me page so, you know to help me with my last study abroad expenses like that transportation and country all that stuff so yes bye critics hope to see you in the next one